Hey guys, you're watching because you want to know only. My name is AJ. Welcome to a food challenge. The next 20 minute challenge that we've got on our list. This might not be what you're thinking. If you're thinking the challenge is to get as much food as possible, then you'd be wrong. The challenge is in fact to get as much different food as possible. If you get 10 steak, you only get one point because it's steak. If you get steak and pork chop, that's two points, okay? So each, you get one point for each different food that you collect. I'm also counting the raw and the cooked variants. So if you get raw pork chop, that's one point. If you get cooked pork chop, that's another point. However, you can't get a raw pork chop, cook it to make it a cooked pork chop, because you only have a cooked pork chop on you then. You need to have both. You need to have two pork chops and cook one of them. That way you'll get one raw one and one cooked one. Okay, obviously our inventory, well, hopefully, uh, I'm predicting us to do well at this, but um, our, our inventory is going to get full. Okay, so what we'll do at that point is make a chest put the food in the chest and leave it there and just remember how many we had in there how many different ones we had in there and then it's my job to remember what we already had and what we're missing okay so what am i counting as food well i'm counting for anything that you can eat pretty much everything in the game makes your hunger go up even if it's just temporary so rotten flesh for example and spider eyes do count as a food some of the foods we're not going to be able to get let's be fun let's let's be honest with ourselves things like cake and golden apples unless we had the seed of last episode last challenge was the die challenge right but it would have been the perfect seed for the food challenge we spawned by a temple which would have actually given us enough gold to make a golden apple which would have been crazy uh we also had the carrots and the potatoes and the wheat there for the bread which would have been three down right off the bat so easy so brilliantly easy but uh i've gone I've, I've written down some of the foods in the game in fact i've written down 28 i think the only things that are missing are uh, the other types of fish so apple golden apple potato baked potato poisonous potato bread cake carrot golden carrot chicken cooked chicken fish cooked fish mutton cooked mutton pork chop cooked pork chop rabbit cooked rabbit rabbit stew cookie melon mushroom stew beef cooked beef pumpkin pie rotten flesh and spider eye i think the only ones that are missing is salmon raw salmon clownfish puffer fish and cooked puffer fish or something like that i don't know the fish too well which is why i've left them off the list uh because i i haven't really experimented at all with the, with the fishes in the game or the fishing since they brought out the update i just find it really boring to be fair uh, so i'm probably not going to do it in this challenge either but there's a few of them to go for there so i'm gonna hit oh i'll just show you first one survival on hard normal texture pack not online game seed is completely blank we're gonna get a random seed there's no like fancy settings in here to make me make it easier for me I don't think there's anything that could make it easier for me anyway, even on a pre-predicted uh, seed. I've got my stopwatch ready this episode, so I'm not rushing to get hold of it. And uh, I think the plan is... I think the plan... Hold on, I want to make sure that I get the start start right. I, when the bar goes up quickly like this, you know that you're like right about to spawn. There, there, start. Okay, so the plan is to make a wooden pickaxe. To then grab as much stone as you can reasonably because we're going to have to make a few furnaces i think like two maybe three furnaces we also want to make a bunch of stone swords if we have like four stone swords on us that should hopefully last us till the end of the 20 minutes another hard part of this challenge is actually making sure that we have enough food for us to survive and not to take away our points because we can actually lose points by eating the food that we need we don't however need to go into a cave we shouldn't need to at least to go into a cave which means that we don't need torches so that's going to save some time we do however it would be nice to get coal to cook the food up a little bit quicker i think that's enough wood to last us the end till the end of the episode oops no 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 we want that we want this. We want to put that down. We want to... Ugh, I don't need these logs at all. We want to make a pickaxe to begin with. 
Just a wooden one. I'm not going to worry about my food at the moment either. I've got a little bit of time first. Oh, look at this. Oh, oh, I think that was a... I don't think that was coal. I think that was a birch tree. It just looked like coal out of the corner of my eye. I will have another look though. So, three. That's all I'm going to grab for the moment. Because I'm going to convert this into a pickaxe. So it's nice and efficient for us. Definitely a lot quicker than a wooden pickaxe. So I'm going to bash this... Oh, hey. We're grabbing this for two reasons. We're grabbing it for furnaces and we're grabbing it for swords. I want to make four swords and uh, and, and let's say let's say three furnaces. Okay, so three furnaces is eight, sixteen, twenty-four. We need twenty-four for the furnaces and then we want um, two, four, six, eight. So we want thirty-two in total. Thirty-two will be a good number and I want to get out of here as well. Because that would also be very helpful. So, there's that. I want to make a bunch of sticks. Oops. I want to make furnaces first. Furnace. 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 And then I'm going to make a bunch of swords. Now, I'm not going to worry about smelting the raw variant to cook variant. Unless I have to for myself until the very end. I think my plan is to leave five. It was a birch tree. Is to leave five minutes um, before the game ends, before the time is up, to cook all of the food. That way, I'm not wasting time along the way. Now, I don't need food at the moment, but I would like to get oh mushroom. Yeah, if we can get a red mushroom, we'll have mushroom stew. Um, wolves do nothing. Is that a sheep over there? No, it's another cow. Oh, but there is... Oh, 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 free food. I'll take free food. So there's raw and cooked mutton, potentially. Oh, pigs? Yes, this is the start that you want. Oh, I'm also going to have a quick look in this cave very quickly for some easy coal. There is. Get that wooden, that wooden stupid pickaxe out of my face. Just making sure that there was no creeper coming up in front of me. I'm pretty sure there's nothing behind me. So we just want enough coal to cook everything. I want one coal to cook some food for me now to hopefully last me till the end of the video because we are going to be going through food um, energy very, very quickly with a lot of jumping, a lot of sprinting, uh, a lot of fighting. So we do need to make sure we have enough. Oh, there's some more here. I'll just take all of this vein. I know it's dark, but I don't really care. <laughs> it was only a short amount of time. So... I'm starting to get hungry. I'm going to put the furnace down here. I'm going to put all but one in this furnace. I'm going to keep one, obviously, for the raw one. That should cook up all of it. There's a cow down here. And I'm going to use any other beef for myself. So I'm going to put that one in there as well. And I can eat all but one cooked beef. So while this is smelting, is there anything... Around. Is there a pig up on a hill? There's some more mutton there. Grabbing more mutton does not help though. Man, those there was loads of sheep around here. <gasps> what it? How much wool have I got? I've got two wool. If I grab that wool, sleeping through the night after we get a spider eye and a rotten flesh could be a game changer. You also get nothing from horses. So I'm not going to bother with the horses. That could be a game changer. Sleeping through the night? It hasn't taken any time out of our day to do either. Okay, I'm actually going to leave it like that. I'm going to I'm going to go now. We've got we should have enough food for myself. I've got 5 uh, at least for the moment, but I don't really want to waste too much time. Pigs, I've got two pork chops. That's all I need. I need one for raw and one for not raw. There was some coal down there, but I'm not going to bother getting it. So, what's the next plan? What's the next... Oh, I probably should have cooked up more beef, actually. I didn't realise I was that low, low on hunger. What's the next one? Rabbits would be nice. Snow biome, I think I usually find the most rabbits in. So, we'll keep an eye out for that. I will grab this. Because I don't think I quite have enough coal on me. As soon as it was sort of on the way up. Let's get a little bit of a vantage point up here. Now, let's go through the list. A village would boost us immensely. A village would allow us to get a ton really, really quickly. You know, I am going to kill these as I go, just in case I need to eat them for myself. 
Okay, and maybe killing these will make other animals spawn. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, I don't need the sheep. I will take this cow, though, since it's on the way. Man, a village would be great. We get carrots. We get potatoes. We get cooked potatoes. And I think if you cook a cooked, if you cook a baked potato, I think you get a poison potato. I think that's how it works. Uh, we can't do nothing with cactus. Um, there could be a village in the acacia biome, I think. I'm not sure. I know you can on PC. Uh, mushroom biome. We've got a brown mushroom. There's a red mushroom over there. That'll give us mushroom stew. Uh, how do you make pumpkin pie, by the way, guys? You don't put a pumpkin and a bowl together, and you don't put the seeds in a bowl together. And I can't remember how to do it. <laughs> I don't think I've ever done it before. So, um... Pumpkin pie might be off this if we find a pumpkin, that is. If I find a pumpkin, I'm going to panic because I don't know how to make it. Uh, melon would be nice. But again, it's only one. A village would sort out a lot of our problems. Now, where was this mushroom? There was a big mushroom in here. I saw it with my own eyes. There we go. Mushroom. Okay. Put down the crafting table. I don't need to gra grab the crafting table afterwards because we should have... Oops. We should have enough wood to last us the rest of the game now. But I'm going to put that in there. That one there. And that one. Oops. And that one there. Mushroom stew. There's another one off the list. I'm going to leave the crafting table there because it's going to take us too long to break. Okay. A village. Please just reveal a village to me. It doesn't look like it. Okay, I'm going to run that way. And while I'm running, I'm going to look on the list of food that we need. Chicken. Chicken is one that we don't have. Apple is one that we don't have. But I don't think I'm going to go for apple until I'm smelting stuff at the end. I'll try and find a forest at the end to start smelting my food in. And then I can break some oak leaves. In fact, a swamp is... You're most likely to get apples in a swamp than in any other biome. Um, bread. Need a village for, really. Um... Unless I get a load of bone meal and then I can make my own wheat. Oh, a flower forest. Of course. That would be fantastic. Oh, it's only a little one. That would have been great for last episode. Uh, <laughs> all my challenges are in the wrong order. The seeds are coming up wrong. Just looking for a village. Um, there's some cows over there. I'll kill. What else we've got down the list? Ow. Walked into a cactus. Fish. Woo. Ow. Don't do that. That sounds like a terrible idea. I, want, I need to get out of here. So now, um, and there's no, like, easy way back. out. Of course there wouldn't be. Okay, uh, uh, no. Uh. I'm trying to do this in, like, the most efficient way, and it's just turning out to be, like, one of the most inefficient ways. There we go. <laughs> um, mushroom stew, cooked mutton and pork. We will. We're pretty much doubling what our score at the end anyway when we cook. We're nine minutes and a half in. I'm just really, I'm sprinting now for a village. Cows, I will take them. I'm going to take any cows that I can. And we might have to do a smelt stop in a minute. To survive. Okay, I'm going to head over this way. To these cows. I'm not going to bother with the pigs, so we've got way more than enough pork chop. Yeah, way more than enough pork chop. Okay, so I've got one left. I'm going to keep running for as long as I can. We're getting towards night time. This is where the bed could really help out. After we get zombie flesh and a spider eye. I mean, they're two that we can check off the list to utilize the night time that we'll have. What else is down the list? Rabbit. Can't really do much about rabbit until I see one. I think we're actually doing better than it looks. It doesn't look like we're doing that well, but wait until we double it. Now, obviously, we can't fail this challenge. There's no way to actually fail. Chicken. Uh, we need two chickens, one raw, one cooked. There's no way to fail it. As long as you get one food, I'm so, you, you've at least got a score. Um, but uh, you can obviously improve. So, comment section, your guy, you, you have to do this challenge. And you know the rules. If you're not 100% sure on the rules, then wait until the end when I total up my score. And you'll hopefully see what I mean about the whole raw and cooked variants. Okay, I'm not going to... I'm going to stop here. I'm going to smell up some beef. All but one. Don't do that. Just going to put that in there for the moment. Oh, no, not. I want all but one, not just one. Okay, I'm going to let that cook up. I'm going to wait around here for some, for some mobs to spawn. 
Man, a village will change the game. We're 11 minutes, 13 seconds in. Okay, I've got a little bit of food. Just, oh, not that one. Just to help me fight some mobs. Come on now. Skeleton, uh, we want a zombie flesh. Oh, I thought I saw light from lava. And a spider's eye. Now, you can't do nothing else with them. You can't cook the the rotten flesh or anything like that. Okay, we've got a creeper spawn. There's a spider and there's a zombie. Can we get lucky and get them both in the first one? Spider eye, I think, is a 25. I got it. I think that's a tw <laughs> marvelous 25% chance of dropping a spider eye. And I think a 50% chance of dropping string. I think that's how it works. Okay, I got zombie flesh as well. I got two bones to make some bone meal. <gasps> a ch another chicken. Beautiful. Okay, I'll tell you what we're going to do. We're going to get the wheat as well while we're here. Do I need a normal? Do I need a bare hand? Man, I got really unlucky with seeds then. I got Oh, I got three. That's all we need. Sweet. Okay, let's make a bed. Crafting table. Crafting table. Uh, do not come up behind me, creepers. Oh, I will be so angry. You would not believe. Okay. If a creeper wakes me up halfway through the night, I might... I should have pillared up if I wanted to be safe. Okay, we're good. We're good. That's excellent. That's really, really good. I'm going to take this crafting table with me. We're t 13 minutes in. Okay, so... Spider eye, rotten flesh, bone meal. We need a hoe. I, oh, I sh should have made the hoe when I had the crafting table open. We want to make a hoe. Do do. Just a wooden one will do. Wooden hoe. And then we want to go by the water. How are you getting on? You're doing good. Okay, I got plenty enough food for more than the rest of the episode now. And there's a... Oh, I should kill him. Just in case this bone meal isn't enough. He shoots underwater? No kidding. Okay, I did pick up. If, I, if he dropped any bones, I did pick them up. So we want to put down these. But it doesn't take just one bone meal anymore. It might take more. We've got six. One, two, three, four, five. Damn you! <laughs> it was it's so close to being full. That's ridiculous. Okay, and uh, we're, we're out of that stuff. Let's pick this back up. Okay, I, I used a wooden one, but it doesn't matter. 14 minutes. We've got one minute before I want to think about sort of starting to smelt stuff up. Come on, just grow. That would be one more down. I should have got one more skeleton. I thought, I thought we were going to be pushing our luck a little bit. How can I get it to grow faster? I can't. There's nothing that I can do to get that to grow faster, is there? Okay, I'll tell you what we're going to do. I'm going to wait here. I'm going to smelt up my food while I'm here. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom. Okay, one chicken. Boom. And one raw chicken. In this one, one cooked one. In this one, one cooked one. Okay, now it's time to clear my inventory so I know exactly... What I'm missing and what I've got. I probably could have made armor out of that. Uh, that. 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 I got a bow and arrows. That's nuts. Um, you can go. You can go. I'm going to keep you for the moment. You can go. Get you on the hotbar. Let's organize this properly. Map can go. Okay. That one. That one. Raw. Raw. Spider eye. Zombie flesh. Wheat. You can go. And you. Okay, so we've got cooked chicken. We've got cooked mutton. We've got, oh, cooked beef. Boom. And we've got cooked pork chop. That still hasn't grown. Anything else? That, apple. Apple. Tree. 
16 minutes in. Okay, don't rush. We've got a little bit of time left here. I say that horse horse is no use to me. Just one apple will get us another point. There's a sapling. Uh, just keep punching. We're not wasting time because we're also waiting for that wheat to grow. And that wheat to grow gives us another point as well. Look at this for luck. Now, punching trees and cutting down trees makes no difference. Makes no difference to the chance of getting an apple. Okay? It makes no difference whatsoever. Uh, it's a myth that's been going around Minecraft people for a very, very long time. It's proven that you there's no greater chance if you cut it down or not. So, we're just being tremendously unlucky. Tremendously unlucky. We've got 17 minutes. I think it's... I think the actual odds, in fact, of getting a apple out of a tree, I think, is 1 in 120. That might I might be wrong there, but I think that that's the number. I'm not going to stretch for that. Oh, let's eat. Ugh. Okay, 17 and a half minutes. We've got three and a half minutes for that wheat to grow. If that wheat grows, I'll be happy. We've got three and a half minutes for it, too. It's like like one section away from being fully grown as well. You know, when this doesn't make an apple, it makes me wonder if it would be best to cut them down. I, I know it doesn't make a difference, but it's like, eh, maybe, maybe just for our luck, it might. So let's do it. I mean, why not? Okay, eight, 18 minutes in. We've got two minutes remaining. There's nothing more that I need to do with my... Um, with my pickaxe, uh, with, with my furnaces or anything like that. There's nothing more that I don't think that I need to smelt. I thought my inventory would be fuller than what it was, but I didn't. I don't know what with. I mean, we could have gone fishing, but that takes at least, let's say, 30 seconds to get one fish, and that's if you're lucky. Um, no, that's a that's a, not that's not an apple on the floor. That's a a, a mushroom. Um, pumpkin. Is, is rare to find. Melon is, is rare to find. Uh, golden apples out. Potato and carrot would have been from a village. In fact, it's probably, th I think, the only way to get them. Unless you can get them in, in mine shafts and strongholds and stuff like that. Look at this. Not a single apple. Um, 19 minutes. Okay, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do 30 more seconds. It's not, the clock on screen for you guys might be a little bit different, but for me, it's 19 minutes, 10 seconds. I'm going to go till 19 minutes, 30, then I'm going to run back to see if that wheat is done. To give me 30 seconds to make something, get over there and make the wheat. Apple! Boom! Okay, sweet, I'm happy now. Please be grown. Please be grown. Please be grown. 30, 19 minutes, 32 seconds. It is grown. Oh, boom, get it. Okay, crafting table. Crafting table. Crafting table. <laughs> Look at the clock. 19 minutes, 50 seconds. Bang, bang, bang. Red, we got it. Okay, so that's going to do 1957, 1958, 1959, 20 minutes. Okay, according to my clock. We ended up with, oops, we ended up with... That's all the food that we've got, yeah? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 points. You know, that's not bad. I'm very, very happy with that. We got all of the easy ones. By that, I mean, like, the steaks, the muttons, the beefs, and the chickens. I would class those as the easy ones. The sort of medium-ish ones... I would say would be the apple because it take although an apple isn't hard to get it's like RNG related it's a bit random to get is apple and mushroom stew rotten flesh is an easy one as well spider eye I would class as a medium one and bread I would class as a medium one so we got a lot of the e we got all of the easy ones and the some of the medium ones it would have been nice to find rabbit 
Rabbit would have been... In fact, let's go down the list. Golden Apple wouldn't have gotten. Potatoes, baked potatoes and poisonous potatoes, I could have got if we found a village. Cake, I was never going to get. Carrot and gold... Ca carrot, I could have got from a village if we found one. Golden Carrot, I was never going to get. Fish, I was never going to bother to try, and nor was I with cooked fish or salmon or raw salmon or anything like that. To get the string would have taken a while, and then to fish would have wasted time. We didn't even have any time to waste. We were knocking down trees. Um, we got the muttons, pork chops. Rabbits, rabbit cooked rabbit and rabbit stew were three that we could have got if we had found just a couple of rabbits. That's a real shame, that is. That's a real shame. That could have been three easy points there. Uh, cookie, we were never really going to get. Uh, we needed the wheat and the uh, cookie, uh, cocoa beans for that. Uh, a mushroom stew we got. And then beef, pumpkin pie, potentially if we were lucky. No, we done well. I'm very, very pleased with the outcome of this one. If you guys enjoyed it, hit that like button. Play the challenge for yourself. Let me know your score in the comment section below. Again, I got 13. Yeah, 6, 12, 13 points. If you guys enjoyed it, hit that like button. If you haven't already, please subscribe. We shall see you in the next episode.